Stage two. Stage two is the creative. So what you've done so far is you've actually physically, you've spent 10 minutes physically warming up your body. Stage two is 10 minutes as well, but it's time to warm up your mind. So stage two is the creative. If I just let you on my drum set and said, go ahead, create, it's just too daunting. There's too many possibilities. And it's like, it's just too much. There's too many options. But if you have some sort of parameter, it's much easier to be creative inside. You get to decide what that is. Maybe you say, I'm gonna play a basic groove and I'm gonna be creative on my bass drum. Cool, you have a structure to be creative inside of. It's not freedom on the kit, but you're being creative inside of a structure. Or maybe you decide, I'm gonna play 16th notes, ghosted on my snare. And I'm gonna play with my accents. Okay, that's great. You have a structure to be creative inside. And I don't think without that structure, you would naturally sit down on the drum set and do something like that. So I want to give you guys at least one, if not two examples of things you could use to be creative with. So the first thing is really tough. It's called the quarter note challenge. And all it is is you just have to play quarter notes with your left hand, constant quarter notes. One, two, three, four and be as creative as you can be, and that can never change. As soon as one note changes from those quarter notes on your left hand, you're out, all right? So Tyler, you ready to give it a go, buddy? Get on up here, bowling shirt. Okay, so, you ready? No, but we're gonna do it anyway. Hell yeah, we are. Embra embrace the suck, right? Embrace the suck? <laughs> so give me some quarter notes, clack, clack. Now play anything you want. Ah! Yeah. Take it, man. I'll take it. Good job. Holy crap. You crushed it. You crushed it. Scott, you want to give it a try? Or no, plaid's coming up next. Yeah, come on up. About right here. One, two, ready. Uh. <laughs> yeah. I'll take it, good job. So, obviously, just being creative and just saying, I'm gonna sit down and create, you can't. You don't have any vocabulary to create with. So you can sit there and think, all right, what if I put one hand between every cross stick? All right, two hands as triplets. Three hands is 16th notes. All right, maybe some bass drum stuff. Okay, so you start working on your vocabulary that allows you to tell a story. Like this. <laughs>
That'll work. So stage two, that's creative. You have to sit inside of a parameter and create. So now you're 20 minutes deep into your practice session. You've warmed up your body completely and you've warmed up your mind. And you're now ready to start stage three and truly practice.